This deserve a Michelin. I'm gonna give. I'm gonna start giving myself Michelins. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my Taiwanese beef noodle soup recipe. So I did have some footage in the beginning. I had one kilogram of beef brisket here, nicely finely chopped into cubes. I got uh, one kilogram of beef shank in this as well, and this has been boiling away for one hour. 20 minutes, <laughs> sorry guys. So, after 20 minutes, are we gonna do? Pull these bad boys out nice and clean. That's how you clean your meat. <laughs> Coming back with three liters of clean water onto our pot. Move this water over, <laughs> move this meat over. Get your wok. Nice beautiful plates of spices. So I got four tablespoons of coriander here. We got four star anise in. We got two, um, what is this? What is this in English? Black cardamom, one cinnamon stick. We got fresh on pepper here, one tablespoon of it, and we got four to six cloves of cloves. <laughs> That's what it is. Toast until fragrant. Nice and fragrant, right into the pool. Into this wok, tablespoon of oil. Let's fire up one ginger, four medium onions, two medium tomato, three small shallots, one clove of garlic, saute until fragrant. We got a beautiful bowl of meat there. I'm going with a tablespoon salt, tablespoon dark soy sauce, two tablespoons of light soy sauce, tablespoon of rock sugar, tablespoon of some Shaoxing wine. Stir fry. Let everybody mellow together. Next out, I got some chili sauce right here. So two different tablespoons. I'm gonna strain all this goodness outside. I'm gonna try to figure out if I have a net or some sort to net this all together. If I don't, I'm just gonna throw it in. Okay, in goes everything. Ooh, everybody in the pool on getting swim. Just have to get in. One big bunch of green onion on top and let that boil on a medium for about two hours, all right? With this, since I don't have a tea bag or anything, I'm just gonna leave this right on top. Let that soak. Taiwanese beef noodle soup complete. Oh man. Noodles in. Only question now is can I just set you up, my angel? So, perfectly cooked noodles or wheat noodles. We got some bok choy on the side. Got the beef, the brisket, and the shank. Coming in hot with a nice breeze broth. Oh, Some scallions. My oh, guys, my Taiwanese braised beef or beef, that beef right here. Order 69, Michelin style. <laughs> now who, who's giving the Michelin? Who's giving the Michelins? This deserve a Michelin. I'm gonna give, I'm gonna start giving myself Michelins. There's no way that can be so many restaurants on Michelin. This restaurant gives you so much hunk of meat. Look at this. That's a beef shank. That's a nice slice of beef shank. Here's another one. Here's a piece of brisket. How do I know? Because I know the chef, eh? <laughs> Three to four pieces of bok choy as well. Who is drooling over this, eh? I'm gonna give this a nice mix. Noodles. I think the noodles are hand pulled. But it's not hand pulled in a restaurant. <laughs> We're just gonna give this a nice broth taste for us because everything leads to the broth, guys. Mm, super pumped for this. Oh, wow. I say this this place needs a Michelin star. <laughs> so good. Very beefy. Um, I would say it's kind of very close to I want to say obviously it's a beef stew right but more aromatic more Taiwanese inspired that's what I say <laughs> okay let's check out these noodles to see if they're hand pulled by I believe I believe it's hand pulled super pumped those nice beautiful wheat noodles Perfect texture. Texture kind of reminds me of um, yum yum yum. You know, it's chewy. It's thick, but not too thick. It's just perfect. 
broth though. I know his whole heart is in there. Mm. Mm. Beef shank. Let's see how soft it is. Oh. Wow. Um. Perfect. Perfect consistency. Consistency? That's good. <laughs> Such a nice bowl goodness on a hot rainy day. It is hot. No. You guys hear that? It's kind of weird. The reason because when it rains in Vietnam, it's hot. <laughs> hot and humid. Mmm. I think the next best thing for this soup, I don't know why, but I feel like I should add some tendon in it. Mmm. I feel some tendon. Oh, that broth though. That tendon will bring up this broth even more. A piece of brisket. Mm. Usually this dish is only known to have beef shank in it. Adding beef brisket in there. Kind of just brings it up a notch because of the fat, you know? Mm. Mm hmm. This definitely, definitely needs its own Michelin staff. <laughs> 